According to Crystal Skulls enthusiasts, as many as 12 of the 13 authentic skulls have been discovered and are in private collections. But where did these so-called authentic skulls come from? And how were they discovered? In the late 19th century, museums in London and Paris displayed crystal skulls as genuine Mesoamerican religious relics. But today, mainstream scientists argue they are all modern creations. They also insist that any analysis of the skulls is incomplete, as quartz crystal cannot be carbon dated. Quartz has no carbon. Quartz actually has no radioactive elements in it. It's pretty much pure silicon. So the quartz itself has no real signature that can be used to do dating. Even getting within 1,000 years or 10,000 years, it gets almost impossible to actually date it. Authenticity is something difficult to determine when they've been analyzed using modern scientific techniques. In some cases, there are suggestions that modern tools were being used. Other people have suggested, however, they were using very sophisticated tools back in ancient times. Like crystal skulls enthusiasts, many ancient astronaut theorists believe that the 12 known ancient quartz skulls do, in fact, have ancient origins and believe they may possess a great, perhaps even otherworldly power one that has yet to be fully revealed. Several Native American tribes have similar stories about ancient crystal skulls that were said to have been left behind by the earliest ancestors way back in the mists of time. Some believe that these are ancient artifacts left behind by extraterrestrials, or that they were remnants left over from the lost civilizations. According to legend, the secret of the skulls will be revealed when the original 13 skulls come together to form a global grid. In fact, there are many who believe that this so-called reunion of the skulls will awaken sacred knowledge of the gods, knowledge that has been hidden from mankind for thousands of years. According to some Native American myths, there are 12 inhabited planets out there and each one of those skulls contains the information from one of these planets, including Earth. And the reason why there's a 13th skull is because the 13th skull contains the knowledge of all those planets. It's basically a backup. <laughs> 